Launch control. What's good? It's Caleb. Back after like almost a year now. It's pretty insane. Well, not a year, but like eight, ten or eight months since my last video, which actually was right after I got this four wheeler. Which is kind of crazy to think because it feels like I've had this forever. I forgot how fucking loud it was. I feel like I'm screaming. But anyways, I'm back for now. I think I'm gonna try to make some videos like pretty often, like a few a week. Cause I just finished school. I went to uh, I went to university for first year. But I just finished. It's almost May now. So basically what happened is I went back after that video, I was working, and then I just moved away to school. So I couldn't really ride much at all during the fall, right after I got this, because I was away at school, because I went to university about an hour away from where I live. So that's pretty much everything that's happened. I've came home a few weekends, but there was the winter, so I couldn't ride during the winter, but even when I came home, I just didn't really want to make videos because I knew that they wouldn't be consistent because I'd only make them during the weekends that I came home, which was like once a month, if that, and then there was winter. So I just stopped making videos, but I'm done now. And uh, university finishes two months earlier than high school. So we have a four month long crap. So we have a four month long summer, which is awesome. And speaking of summer, it is like April 27th, I think, when I'm filming this. And it is like 25 degrees. But anyways, there has been a lot that has happened, especially with like riding, because I'm at the pit right now that we always ride at. But probably right after that video, I don't think I made any videos about the pit. It got pretty much flattened, well part of it, like the main part, because this wasn't the part that we mainly rode in before. Like all this part is still the same. But what basically happened was the main bowl part where all the jumps are and stuff got flattened because the guy who owned it like, I don't know, some of the government paid for it and they just flattened it so people wouldn't ride there anymore. And that was probably like a week after I bought my new four-wheeler, which sucked because basically after that, there was like there was this part, but this part has gotten a lot better now this year. There wasn't much to it last year. Right after they flattened it, people just stopped coming. Like every weekend there was like, there just gotta be like a, 50 people here at once at all times during the weekends. And then it, it was just dead because they flattened it. And you can see there, it's like trapped. Over there, it's like they blocked off all the entrances, but people made new entrances like this. Whoa. So you can still get in there. But now it's like just a big fucking mud hole. Oh, oh, I don't want to get muddy. So this is it now. It's just fucking flat, which really does suck. Basically right here where I'm riding, there was like a big bowl that went higher than the top here. And it went all the way down here and there was a big bowl around it and a whole bunch of jumps. And it was all flat. Now it's all bumpy, but it's like a giant mud hole.
but I remember the day that I came in here. Because we had normally come in way down there. And I came in and just think it was like just like a normal day because I hadn't seen it yet. And I come in and there was like massive bulldozers and excavators that were over there just fucking destroying the pit and it was like fuck because what like I just bought a four wheeler like where are we gonna ride now so that's basically what happened last summer I got my four wheeler they demolished the pit I ended up going away to school for a year and now I'm back and I wow. <laughs> I have missed riding while I was away so much like, I came back quite often, maybe twice a month or once a month, in my first semester during fall. And I would ride with my buddies, but after that, it was winter, and then I, pretty much the second semester, second half of the year, I didn't come home at all, except for reading week, which was still during pretty much winter, so I couldn't really ride. So I went a long ass time without riding. <laughs> and it is insane. Like I've never gone that, ever since getting a four wheel, I've never gone that long without riding. Even like through the winter, I'd always ride. It's insane how much I actually missed it. It was like, it was awesome come back. And especially now this side of the pit that they didn't fly. People have been riding here a lot more, like dirt bikes and sport quads. They made like a mini track. But it never gets old. And something too I have been thinking about is buying a new quad. I've got a new quad pretty much every year. <laughs> for like three years now. Going from a shitty Chinese Baja 250. So then the 300EX, and then I only had the 300EX for like half a year, and then to this last year. Actually, maybe I had the 300EX longer. But I really want to get a 450R, or just any 450 really. I'm kind of actually leaning towards the Yamaha, but I don't know if I'm going to get one yet because I have to pay for school and stuff. And honestly, right now, I do not have a job. Because, well, I do have a job but at a golf course, but it wasn't 40 hours a week, so it wasn't really full time. Well, sometimes it was, but I, it was shitty work. I don't want to do it anyways. So I've been looking for jobs. I do have an interview tomorrow for like a landscaping job with the federal government. So maybe if I get a full-time job, it might happen. I still got it! So I hope you guys enjoyed this little uh, update video. If this is your first time watching, please subscribe. And hopefully there'll be some more videos in a few days even. So we'll see you guys later. Have a great day. Bye. Bye.